Dennison. I'm Caleb Dennison, and this is DT Daily. Coming up, Instagram takes us to the movies, a prototype camera keeps its eye on the ball, and a parking valet that goes wherever you go. We all knew that Facebook was going to unveil video for Instagram at its press event Thursday. No shocker there. But the features included in the app's upgrade were a pleasant surprise. It captures up to 15 seconds of video, and of course, it wouldn't be Instagram without a set of filters. But the winner is a cinema stabilization feature that does an amazing job of removing that user-induced Blair Witch Project style shaky hand filter. It also allows you to choose a thumbnail from any frame in the video. And you can easily post the clip to Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Flickr, and Foursquare. Now, go make yourself a movie. No matter how quickly you can pan a camera to follow the action, a fast-moving object like a golf ball in flight is one of the toughest things to capture. But this new prototype camera makes it look easy. It uses a system of mirrors to follow a moving object, processing the image 1,000 times a second and keeping it perfectly in the center of the frame. And since most of the camera stays stationary, it can pan 180 degrees in the blink of an eye. The camera shoots in full HD and is already being tested at sporting events. I just hope they don't use it to shoot tennis or ping pong. Did you see that demo? I think I'd lose my breakfast at Wimbledon, if you know what I mean. Valet parking attendants, I'm afraid your days are numbered. Volvo's new experimental park assist technology can park a car without anyone behind the wheel. You simply pull up to a parking structure and pop out of the car. From there, the Volvo takes over, searching through the structure for an open spot. When it finds one, it parks itself. And when you're ready to be picked back up at the original drop-off spot, you just call the car with a smartphone app and it comes back to you. It uses autonomous technology to avoid pedestrians and other hazards and can operate in existing parking structures. That's cool, I guess. But how about autonomous hit the drive through technology or autonomous pick up the kids after school for me technology? We'll see. And that's DT Daily for this week. We'll see you on Monday.